Right, hello folks. I'm going to make a journal. Okay, I will be doing tags in this video, I think, because I want to use a new tag kit and sort of like get, pull some out that might go with what I'm doing here. Okay, so um, Jana made this sort of like embroidery thing, which I should make sure. She did machine stitch some of this and she hand embroidered as well. And I just thought it would go very, very nice with the new um, freebie that I've done. Plus this, um, if you look this sort of time around this sort of time last year, there's there's ones that will go with this as well. I've just pulled out what what's near to me and a, a few bits and pieces. Okay, I think these were like um, the the collage mini collage tasters so because there's green ones isn't there there's blue there's all sorts it's yellow so i've just pulled out a few things so at the moment i'm not saying th these pages are going to stay the same because that's why i don't tell you what how many is in there or anything because they change depends what i do yeah and that, that's sort of in the middle at the moment and that's going to go in there yeah um, I just, I like this, I think it's from one of the wallpaper kits. This is going quite nicely as well. So this might go on, you know, like the centre page here to make a pocket or something like that. So I'm keeping that together. Yeah. And this, oh, I'm going to keep that because I'm going to cut one of them down because that, that fits quite nicely in there. Um, this is a piece of felt yeah that's been coffee stained and it's sticky back felt stuck to a piece of grunged up paper okay and that's going to be stitched to the inside of that okay yeah so that's all together but right where i've cut down some of the pages which as you know i do do not like waste <laughs> i thought i would Oh, oh, that's just the size of my pages there, so that's how I do it. I just fold a bit of paper up and then usually make that as a template, but I didn't even go that far. Right, I've got these that I cut off. Okay, so I thought, even the plain ones, I'm going to collage on here. And um, we'll make something, some tags or something used throughout the journal. Okay, what I'll do, I'm just going to go ahead and sort of like off camera, just cut these white edges off, all these things. And maybe cut these down, all right, into odd bits, long strips and that. So I'll just cut them down. Um, there we go. All right, so I'll come back when I've cut some of them down. I think that might be enough, but I've got bits around me if I need it. Right, so I've cut them all down. All right, so I'm just going to use a, a glue stick today, not um, too worried about anything. So, I'll sort of, I'll do it in threes. A bit of a wonky edge on that side, so I'll do that so that it can. All right, and I'm, I'll try and sort of leave the edges clear. So we can tuck if need be. I am going to put something over that. There. Oh. <laughs> That's good, isn't it? That's where I like actually going over the page. So I can cut it down. There we go. Right, let's do that first. Sorry, I am very mucky. <laughs> I should be doing it on a book, really. <laughs> Haven't got any space. Hold on a minute. <laughs> Let's put that there. Right, okay. <laughs> I don't want to use one of my good ones, do I? 
There we go. <laughs> I can see myself just getting into a mucky mess today for some reason. <laughs> So now I'm just gluing that side. <laughs> That's a trouble when you're ambidextrous. So you just, sometimes you don't know which side to to use. And I'm a bit like that when I was bowling. I really got confused sometimes. One minute, I'd, like half of the game, I would do right-handed and then left-handed. And everybody would go, why? And I'd go, I don't know. But perhaps my, that arm's tired. <laughs> I think actually we've got enough plain, haven't we? So let's start filling in with some.
Okay. <clears throat> yeah, that's it, I think. Okay, right. So, oh, I haven't got much left. Just a few bits, but that's all right. They'll come in handy for other things. So, put them in the bit box. Might even make some clusters with that to go with the journal. So, um, I might do those in a minute. <laughs> Just so that they're not hanging around. Because sometimes if you put them in a bag or a box, that's it. Don't do anything with them, but they're on there now, and I've got a few bits around me. I'll, I'll just make stuff up. And don't mean to say that I will use it, but and I'll leave that dry. And while that's drying, I'm going to use make up some little clusters. Okay, I'd, I'd rather that be dry a bit more. I know it's um glue stick, but. Right, okay. What have we got here? So I've got a few bits hanging around because I've been doing the tags, haven't I? So I'll leave those. I do that as as far as I go and then I put some stitching stitching on and then afterwards I might put add a butterfly I do that quite a lot actually only because sometimes I haven't got things around me so I just need to get rid of that little bit of white there as it is because that lends itself to a butterfly or something but all right Locking on, uh, so I had to get it the right size. <laughs> I want to show some of that off, so. And put some stitching just stitch these down okay because normally i just put them together and stitch rather than wasting a load of glue all right so i'll go ahead and stitch them and then come back to you here they go all done all that ones i've done singly didn't i but these i just um do them all at the same time <laughs> So I'll just cut them off after. Okay. It's quicker that way. I'll show you them in a minute. I meant to do this before I come on camera, but right, so there these are all bits now the snippets, all right, or clusters that we can actually work on and build on. You know, add a butterfly, add a flower, whatever, but they're they're ready. Yeah. I'll trim off some of these as more of that. These look quite good down the side of a page. <clears throat> All little bits. Alright. But that's cleared. Just a few bits here, but I'm not worried about that. I like a few bits left. This is my inspiration pile. <laughs> or let's get inspired pile. <laughs> 
to see what we can do with it. There we go. Okay. So that's our little collection of those clusters to go with what we're doing. All right. And shall we see if any of the tags are going to go with this journal? Well, they are. I actually quite like that too. I might have to make a tag out of that there. And that one. Look at those. These make really good tags, these books. Oh, that's why I didn't use it because I was. Uh, because I like both sides. Right, let's have a look. I know there is some green ones because I did put them in because I knew I'd be doing um, nature. Let's stay away from blue. Let's go to this. Well, there's bird ones. We'll definitely go these ones. These there, blue. And green will be getting nice actually that could work too oh definitely any of these really Right, let's look at my snippets. Let's spread them out, get a feel for what's going on. Yeah, really like those. Right, so we've got that. That there's another one, a plainer one. Yeah. So say this one, you wouldn't need, you know, if, to keep it that side, you wouldn't need anything on there. But you could, say, put something down here. Something might speak to me. Just for added texture. I'm not sure about that. That actually could be quite nice look. Yeah, I'm going to put that there. I like that. And then just cut off the ends. I know I'm covering that bit of lace up, but I don't mind. Put another real bit down the bottom. <laughs> And don't forget we've got a backlist so it won't feel so floppy. That's definitely going in. So that one's done, except for back in and stitching around, which you've seen loads of those. Right, this one I think lends itself to having a tag on the top. Right, let's get the ones that you might want. Yeah, there was one, oh, it was a little bit sort of um, one bird here, but this was a very old um, image. Okay, so it's slightly, slightly um, blurry, but not too much, you know, not pixelated or anything. But I did know it was there, but I really liked the colour, so that's why I left it in. But I gave you plenty. It's just that I did notice when it printed, it was a little bit, you know. Quality not 100% there, but that was the only one. The rest were fine. It was just such an old image that um, the quality just wasn't there, but I liked it. So, but you got more than enough. So that one and I 
quite liking so what well, if we go for that then because i've got quite a bit of yellow in that um in this clusters there haven't i so Just playing here. <laughs> no idea where my mind goes, I'll tell you. <laughs> Cut that off square. Might as well trim that while I'm here. around mine so um did I do a small plain one that's what I want I hope I did them oh no they are yep Might just need to trim that down a little, little bit. Okay, but that's what I'm thinking of at the moment. No, a bird's, bird's knife. That was plain. I'd have a bird coming out. Put my finger there because I don't want no glue past that. Still tuck that in, yeah. Might just need a tiny bit more, but I'll trim that off in a minute. Right, so I'm going to stitch around mine. Do we back it now? Yep. Yeah. I'm going to stitch around that first and then back it and then stitch all the way around. Okay. And come back to you. These butterflies, I think they're on my Kofi as well. I think I put them on there last year. I don't know, but they're somewhere. These butterflies are going to go beautifully. I'll have to see if I can find where where they are. So I don't know I've got any of these cut out. So I'll cut some of them out as well. But these are going to go really nicely. I think that size. Too overpowering. So I've got to put it here. So and it's got a little bit of blue in. Got the yellow. A little bit of sort of this colour. So... Yeah, cause, because these are already printed, you know, and I've, I've spotted them when going through my s sort of papers that are hanging around here. So it couldn't have been that long ago. Um, and I saw them and I thought, no, they're, they're going to go really nice with these. Okay, right. Okay, so they're all sort of... Um, stitched around okay and that fits now i just trimmed a tad more off of there okay that fits in there quite nicely yeah and um i'm not going to put any stuff on any of this because i'm not sure whether blue will come ar around in the journal or green yet so i'm not going to do that but i will put one of these stickers on here because we've got that bold print there i think on this one we just need something very simple. So these vellum stickers are absolutely brilliant for this. Okay. 
and I'll put the butterflies on as well. I did cut one of the cut one of the butterflies out, so and it's so that it's right on that edge there. Okay. This is where I usually rip them. <laughs> I usually just ink up a little bit where, because it's on the light, it's okay. Okay, but when it goes up on something darker, sometimes you just need to ink up the edges a bit. Okay. So that then fits in here. That's just, there we go. Like so. But this, I wanted it to come out like that, so... That's right, that's the butterfly I cut out. And if you look, it actually went with that one because of the blue and everything. And it did go with that one, okay? But I think I'm gonna use a grid because I, I only cut out one, but this is from my other stash. I got loads here. And I thought that looked nice, but also that looks nice. <laughs> so uh, it's, it doesn't matter which one. <laughs> And there we go. All right. So, yeah, it's only two today. But that's because I've been, um, I'm doing other, you know, doing the journal as well. So, I have got that one ready to do. That was the page I showed you. And I chose that one because it looked like the best one to cut out. And I thought he would look nice. That's what the actual butterfly is. So, which is quite nice sometimes to... So put that on, okay. But I ran out of time now. Whilst the video will be a bit long. Okay, so that's next time. But we'll have a look, see what they look like within the pages. Yeah. Let's see where, I've got to put this on because I just love looking at that so much. <laughs> so beautiful. <gasps> oh. I love it. I even like these bits just hanging. Very talented, my sister. But, um, no, she doesn't like social media, folks. She really struggles with it and everything. So, right, that's just bits I've got that's been hanging around. Right, let's have a little look. See what we think. Right, there's a page here. No, um... That could go, but there's quite that blue is coming out on there, and I think I have got a page with a bit of blue in somewhere. That's got blue in, so that could look quite nice like that because if you see, it's got blue, got a little bit of green, and that's working. All right, let's bet that one works as well. Yeah. <laughs> there so both of those well, I would um, it has to be on that page really or else that's gonna stick right out but then it's been backed so that could look okay yeah so see but they're all going and that one will 
definitely go look. <laughs> so we'll that one when it's done. <laughs> yeah, so you can see where I'm coming from. So that that's just out of that tag kit, you know, and this was just a random journal I decided to put together this morning. So and I went to the tag kit and there was tag, there was colours in there that went beautifully. Right, here is the collage. Um, I'm going to, what I'm going to do with this is scan it in because every single thing of this is mine. Oh, well, if anybody's going to sue me over a bit of <laughs> checkered paper or lined paper, well, <laughs> bring it on, I say, because <laughs> I don't know whose that is. <laughs> but it's no, not a digital maker, it's actually a, out of a book or something. Right, so yeah, everything else is mine. And so I'm going to scan this in. I'll make it into something. Okay, and it will be available on my Kofi. Yeah, I might even make, sort of, cut the tags out of it because I can reproduce it, a couple, you know, more than once, can't I? So I might make some tags, might make a couple of envelopes. Um, actually, a coin envelope would be nice because that I could do it to fit that journal, which would be lovely. So we'll see. Okay, I'll come up with something anyway and put it on the Kofi. All right. So I'll scan that in and that will make up for only doing two tags but actually i've done three <laughs> okay then speak to you all very soon bye